Mom Training Podcast with Diana Ballard. Hey mama, with all of us stuck in our homes so much more right now, this is the perfect time for us to be focusing on increasing our skills as a mom, wife, and housewife. If you're tired of wasting time, feeling like crap, and not knowing how to organize yourself, go over to dianaballard.com and sign up for mom training right now. Don't waste another minute practicing the same habits that you have been that have been getting you the same results. So go to dianaballard.com and sign up for mom training. So today's episode, we're going to check in to see how you're feeling. So if you're like me, maybe you didn't think this way, but when all this went down, like the end of March, I was like, okay, cool. We quarantined for a while and then life is going to go back to normal. (laughs) But as we've seen, things are not going back to normal. You know, schools are closed, you know, husband's jobs are still iffy because, you know, businesses are struggling. I mean, it's just the list of things that are still continuing to happen is there. So how are we feeling right now? Are we wishing and hoping that things will go back to normal? Or are we going to have to adjust? Are we going to have to be adaptable? to the new things that are coming, the new, you know, jobs that are going to rise up that maybe, you know, some of our husbands might have to transition to, or, you know, being a stay at home mom completely now because, you know, kids aren't able to go to school or, you know, we refuse to send our kids to a complete sterile environment where there's no recess and, you know, have to wear masks all day. It's like, you know, I guess I'm going to be staying home all the time. So, I mean, I had planned on sending my daughter to a little charter school. She's in kindergarten this year. But we've decided that now I'm homeschooling. So that will be interesting. (laughs) And, you know, bringing her home, making, um, you know, daily lessons, getting a curriculum. I mean, it's a lot. I mean, there's a lot that us as moms are dealing with right now with, um, you know, trying to cover all of our bases. So how are we doing? How are we feeling? And is there a way that we can relieve some stress, take off some pressure, and enjoy the moment more? Because as much as we want it to go back, I think this is going to be a big change for everybody. I, you know, I just, oh, it's going to get better after, you know, this time and I th- think that our main focus now, after this has gone on for months and it could continue to go on longer, is how can I learn how to adapt? How can I use my mind to release some stress and have a positive and hopeful outlook on what the future beholds and the changes that are coming into the future from the changes that are happening right now. Because there's a major temptation to feel like we want to throw in the towel, be like, this is all too hard. I don't know if I can do this. Like, I, this is such a struggle. But realistically, we can't continue doing it this way. We have to be able to see, okay, it looks like things are changing. Life as we know it is changing. So instead of continuing to be hopeful that things will go exactly back to normal, how can we take this moment and make it our new normal? How can we take this moment and adapt and say, okay, looks like I'm going to need to do some things differently. I'm going to need to increase my skills in my home. I'm going to need to increase my ability to teach my kids if I'm homeschooling I'm gonna have to increase my ability to save more money right now because you know maybe there's been budget cuts or we're living on a you know our savings or living off food storage where we're having to make food out of things we have in our pantry or have stored for years (laughs) and are now learning how to have to cook with I mean this is the time for us to rise up to rise up you guys and adapt 
to the new environment and become good at what we do. This is a great time. This is the time that is pushing us to be more, become more, learn more than we maybe have ever had to been pushed to do. See this as an opportunity to push you to learn new skills, to grow as a person. You know, maybe we've been in a comfort zone for quite a while. Maybe things have been squishy. Things have been going great. You know, little tiny things that have been a struggle. We've worked through them. We've been resilient. We've, you know, had a good time most of the time. And then all of a sudden, it's like, whoa, time for a paradigm shift. Time for me to step it up. And that's, I want you to see it like that. We are being asked to step it up. We are being asked to step it up in our home. And that that's what this opportunity is. And to see it as an opportunity and a time that we can thrive and step it up, that's going to change your environment immensely. Instead of thinking, I'm a victim of circumstance. You know, this is all just happening around me. I don't have any control over it. What you do have control over is what you're doing with the situation. And what you're going to do next, what you're going to learn, how you're going to step it up, what you're going to be for your family. This is stuff you do have control over. You do have control over. So don't be afraid of that. You know, do some soul searching. See what, see what is, you know, most important for you to focus on right now, you know, and to learn and learn those skills, learn the things that are going to help you succeed during this time and shift your focus, shift your amount of joy that you're having right now. It's totally possible for this moment to be a springboard for something beautiful and something bigger than you've ever built yourself. You know, let's make our homes a place that is beautiful and peaceful and organized And be organized as a mom and love our life (laughs) and be able to have fun with our kids and have a stronger relationship with our husband. Let's step it up, learn the skills that we need to, to make this time a flourishing time, a happy time, and be with our family and to love them. So that's what I want to encourage you is to not see this moment, start to shift your thinking to not see this moment as a time that is restrictive, but see it as a moment that's pushing you to become better, a better mom, a better wife, a better housewife, just a better person. This is your moment right now to choose to stand up, to step it up, and create something awesome in your home. If you need help with that, check out mom training. We're doing some cool stuff over there. Learning, this is the exact moment that moms need to be learning new skills and increasing their skills. And you don't have to do it alone. You don't have to do it alone. I hope you have a great rest of your day and figure out the things that you need to learn to practice, to implement, to become, to make this time an awesome time. And when you look back and say, I stood up, I rose to the challenge, and man, I feel freaking good at the end of it. Hope you have a great day and we'll see you next week on the Mom Training Podcast. Hit subscribe so you don't miss anything. You can hit me up on social media at Diana Ballard Live or on my website at dianaballard.com. See you next week.